What's going on, y'all? It's the KJ Nolan here, and I'm back with another video for y'all. Welcome to the Pin Game Portfolio. All right, and I want to talk to y'all today about this new company called Royal. So Nas and Jordan Lucas have recently invested in a new NFT platform called Royal, started by EDM artist and producer Blau. Um, Royal is a new blockchain platform that allows artists to sell fractional shares of their music NFTs, which means that you can put up the NFT of your music, um, you know, whether that's an image or whatever and you know the music could come with it and your fans actually can buy into it this is something that's more like music royalties in the world of nfts the company actually just raised over 55 million dollars from a list of heavy hitters including the caa agency uh and dreesen horowitz coinbase and artists like nas joiner lucas logic and the chain smokers all right now to show proof of concept blau actually released 333 tokens that allowed fans to share a 50% streaming share ownership of his latest single, Worst Case. All right, so 333 of his fans got to buy in and own up to 50% of his new single, Worst Case. He retained 50% and his fans got to buy into the other 50%. Now that means that whatever he generates in royalties, sales, etc., like they get to make money off of that and they can resell those shares if they so choose to within two weeks of the song being um released it was already valued at over six million dollars all right so that means if the song is let's just say on a low end if it made six million dollars he made three and his other fans own three million dollars and it's only 333 of them that are in those shares so they got a significant amount of that you know what i mean they're not rich but they got it they came up now for those that actually bought in the tokens have actually generated over six hundred and fifty thousand dollars in resales all right so the people that have decided to um flip their shares and sell it to somebody else they've made over six hundred and fifty thousand dollars over 120,000 artists have signed up to use the platform since it launched earlier this year they just uh, they just launched this company during the summer of this year, man. So for there to be 120,000 signups already, it's crazy, man. And I wanna address those out there that uh, feel like NFTs are just a trend or, you know, just a flash in the pan. I understand it because it is a trend and it is a fad right now, but it's also a developing business, all right? A lot of corporations and companies are investing a lot of money into the blockchain and into um, NFTs. So this is not something that's gonna quickly pass. Now how big are artists going to continue to win in this space i don't know because there's a lot of smaller nft platforms that are coming into play that are allowing artists to sell their music and their content at much lower prices so these uh people that are making thousands upon thousands of dollars off of one particular nft mint um they're the anomalies but um i think there are going to be more sustainable resources where you can make hundreds if not 50 to 25 to 75 you know those type of increments off of nfts which also is not bad for artists when we're in a space today where we're getting pennies on the dollar for our streams and trying to figure out other ways that we can move our content without having to revert back to selling cds and things of that nature in order to um, make a larger profit for the work that we put in. About 10 years ago, people thought Bitcoin was a flash in the pan and a trend and a fad and it's still here and it's worth more now than it was back then. So you gotta understand that eventually things change. The way things used to be when we were growing up, they're gonna evolve and they're gonna become something different. But that does not mean that that's bad. You know what I mean? It just means that you have to continue to adapt and at least have an open mind if you wanna be able to move forward with the times and make money. Because if you look around today, you know, there's nothing wrong with having a job or a career in, you know, corporate business structure. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing wrong with that. However, a lot of people are starting to know that that's just not the way for them you know what i'm saying and gig work is becoming more and more popular even to the point now where i'm sure at the company you work for you have people that work there but they're not actual employees of the company you know what i'm saying they're gig workers they're con they're under contract for a certain period of time and they can renew the contract or they can go somewhere else and it's just showing you that we're not moving in the same way that our parents and our grandparents used to move 50 to 100 years ago all right 
So keep that in mind. And shout out to Blau. Shout out to Nas, Joyner Lucas, Logic, who have already invested in this company, Royal. I'm going to be watching it. I'm going to be signing up and seeing how soon I can actually get accepted because I want to research this stuff, man. And I want to be a part of the movement. So stay tuned. And you already know, once I see the other side of the pasture, I'm going to tell you how it went. Make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe, all right? We really need those subscriptions so we can get to that thousand. And I want to get you guys' opinions in the comments, man. People keep watching these videos, but don't say nothing to me talk to me man let's interact let's engage i'm trying to build a whole music community here that's what the pin game portfolio is for all right peace